Hi everyone. This is Byte Further, a channel sharing valuable iPhone and iPad news and tips. Today's video is about what to do when your iPad says iPad unavailable try again in one hour. Since iOS 15.2 software update was released, you guys may have been stuck with unavailable iPad try again in one hour screen for different reasons. Maybe your son attempted the wrong passcode too many times. As a result, his iPad becomes unavailable and stuck in the locked mode. It says iPad is unavailable try again in one hour. Sometimes, your iPad is locked out showing security lockout try again in one hour. You're trying to get your son's iPad out of an unavailable screen. However, there is no keypad to enter the passcode again to unlock. And you can't turn it off to bypass the unavailable screen either. Perhaps you get the unavailable iPad message with try again in an hour because you totally forgot your 4 digit or 6 digit passcode. You can't remember the right code so it seems that there is no way to access the iPad again without the passcode. Maybe you're trying to restore or update your iPad. On startup, you will unfortunately get locked out of the iPad. It comes up with a black screen displaying iPad is unavailable for one hour. Under the unavailable message, you also see an erase iPad button. At times, you're likely to have an unavailable iPad locked for an hour when charging and can't get in. Whatever, we're here to help troubleshoot a locked iPad and unlock the unavailable try again in one hour screen. iPad unavailable mode is used to prevent unknown users from getting into your iPad. It's often triggered when the passcode was entered incorrectly too many times. And you will also see the try again in one hour timer under the unavailable iPad message. Normally, the one hour timer will be going down. You will see iPad unavailable try again in 59 minutes, 58 minutes, 55 minutes, and so on. After this time period has expired, it'll give you the keypad to enter the right passcode and get into the locked iPad. If you don't remember the passcode, you have no alternative other than to delete everything on the tablet to bypass the unavailable one hour screen and unlock iPad. There are mainly three ways to factory reset your iPad when it says iPad is unavailable try again in 60 minutes. We'll show you them one by one to unlock unavailable iPad, iPad mini, iPad Air, and iPad Pro. Take note of that if you don't have a previous backup, the data will be gone forever after the reset. Now. Let's start. The first way is to use Erase iPad button. Erase iPad will be automatically shown up at the same time when your iPad is saying unavailable try again in one hour. What is it? It's a button introduced by Apple to help get into the unavailable iPad without a passcode. Here's how to use it. Tap the Erase iPad button. In the next screen, tap the Erase iPad button again. Here, enter the password for the Apple ID logged into your locked iPad to go on. When prompted, tap the erase option to confirm. As you can see, the phone shut down and then show up the Apple logo and progress bar. It's erasing your iPad to fix the unavailable try again in one hour screen and open it. If everything goes well, the iPad will reboot itself after the reset. When you see the hello screen, it means you've successfully unlocked the one hour unavailable iPad. Quickly set it up as how you set it up when you get it the first time. Yeah. Your iPad is unlocked. Note that the erase process will start only when your iPad has wireless or cellular network. If there is no network and your iPad remains unavailable and shows dry again in 1 hour or 59 minutes, try the next way. The second way is to log in iCloud to erase iPad. When you get a new iPad and set up the Apple ID, the Find My feature is turned on by default. One of the most important functions of this feature is to reset and unlock a locked iPad remotely without needing a passcode. Here's how to use it. Open any browser and go to iCloud.com. Then, enter Apple ID that's used to log into your one hour unavailable iPad. Enter the two-factor verification code if asked. Once entered the iCloud homepage, scroll down and click the green Find My icon. Enter your Apple ID password again if asked. In the middle top of the page, choose All Devices option. In the drop-down menu, choose the name of the iPad that says Unavailable Try Again in one hour. Then, choose Erase iPad option. When asked, choose Erase again to confirm. A few seconds later, it'll start erasing the data and settings on the iPad and install the latest iPodos software into the tablet.
When you see the Hello screen, you get past the unavailable iPad try again in one hour screen and unlock the tablet. Quickly set up your iPad and use it as normal again. The third way is to use a computer to unlock the iPad. Have a Windows or Mac OS computer? Great! It's also a useful tool to help you unlock an iPad lock screen when it says unavailable try again in one hour. First of all, download iTunes or Finder software on your computer. It's Apple's official software to help unlock iPad and regain access without passcode or Apple ID password. Then, use a USB cable to connect your iPad to the computer. Next, go into recovery mode in your iPad that's locked with a message saying unavailable try again in one hour. Here's how to do it. In an iPad with a home button like me, press and hold both the home button and top power button until you see the recovery mode screen. In an iPad without a home button, quickly press the release volume up button and volume down button and then press and hold the top power button. Don't let it go until you see the recovery mode screen. When you see a connect to computer icon showing up on the screen, you're in recovery mode. After that, go to iTunes or Finder. In the screen that pops up, choose Restore. Select Restore and Update. Follow the steps that the software asks you to do. And all that's left to do to remove the unavailable one hour screen is to wait. One hour, two hours, or three hours. This depends on your internet speed. When you see the Hello screen, your iPad is unlocked and get back to normal status. Quickly set up your iPad and use it again. The last way is to seek help from Apple. No success and iPad keeps returning to iPad unavailable one hour screen? Then, contact Apple support to help you get into your lock iPad that says unavailable try again in one hour. The technicians at Apple's Genius Bar near you will be friendly to save you out. Now, here comes Byte Further's FAQ part. Why does my iPad say unavailable try again? There are four possible reasons. 1. You've forgotten passcode and enter the wrong passcode multiple times. 2. Someone else types the passcode incorrectly too many times. 3. Software installation bugs. 4. Charging issues. How long will my iPad say iPad unavailable? Depending on how many times you've entered the wrong passcode, how long iPad unavailable will be last may be different. The iPad unavailable message will be last 1 minute, 5 minutes, 15 minutes, 1 hour, 3 hours, and 8 hours. When the wrong passcode was entered more than 10 times, your iPad will be stuck in an unavailable screen forever unless you bring it back to its factory settings. Thanks for watching this video. If this video helps, please give it a thumbs up, comment below to let us know which method helps, and share it to Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, etc. Be sure to subscribe Byte Further channel to learn more tech tips about iPhone and iPad. Also feel free to leave a comment down below with any other questions. See you in the next video.